This forecast is powered by Johnson's Appliances and Betty, located in Ocean City and Wildwood, or online at johnsonsappliances.net. And a very happy hump day Wednesday morning to you, my friends. It is 515. Thank you so much for waking up early with me. Today is going to be uncomfortable. The best way I could possibly describe it, check this out. You get free tickets to the comedy club, never a bad thing, but you get there. And the opening act, he's either tired or he's just not having a good day or, frankly, he's new at it. You don't know whether you should be laughing with him or at him. Kind of awkward, right? Very uncomfortable. Well, today is going to be very similar to that. You just don't want to be outside as you're going to be immersed in a wall of water. As soon as the sunshine comes up, we're looking at sunny skies. No issues in that department. Looking great, just not feeling great. Temperatures are going to rapidly warm into the upper 70s, into the 80s, and eventually around 90 degrees a little bit later on. Let's take a look at our big picture for today. Doesn't it look like cart? from, uh, what's that show, uh, South Park, that's it, just sweating there. A lot of us feel that way right now even. It's only going to get worse into the afternoon. So we're watching this frontal system that's just to our north, cutting through the New York metro area right now. That front's going to begin to move down to the south. That's going to be the catalyst behind some showers and thunderstorms that will likely be sparked late tonight and into the day tomorrow as that frontal system kind of dies on top of the area. High pressure is directing the winds out of the southwest, and that's what's bringing up the moisture content in the air. It's also what is pumping up our numbers, our highs today, likely in the lower 90s for a lot of you with those showers, mainly to the north for most of the day, moving to the south later on tonight. Right now we're sitting at 70 in Pittsburgh, 72 in Philadelphia, 69 for Atlantic City, 67 up in Scranton. And we don't have much in terms of cloud cover out there, mainly to the north right now over the uh, Great Lakes area, northern Pennsylvania, New York State. Look at this nice area of sunshine that's eventually going to be with us. Clouds will try to increase later on from north to south but not before we try to get up to around 90 degrees for a lot of us. Spotty showers and thunderstorms will likely develop at some point tonight, lasting into the overnight period. And then tomorrow, as that system is kind of decaying, we're going to see that perpetual chance of showers moving through the area. And don't get me wrong, we need that. So I'm not complaining one bit whatsoever. Blackwood 92 today, Vineland at 90, Hamilton 91, 85 in Atlantic City and Stone Harbor. West southwest winds at 5 to 15 miles an hour. Our dew points, this is the measure of moisture in the atmosphere. This gives you a good indication of what it feels like anytime you get up to 70. It's bad, all right? But look at the yellow starting to come in back to our map here. Early tomorrow morning, by the time we wake up, it's going to feel great out there. Dew points are going to be backing down into the 40s and 50s. You take the dew point and the air temperature and you marry them together and you get the real feel number. This is your heat index. That value, 96 today in Mays Landing and Hamilton, as well as Millville, Fortescue, and Bridgeton, it's going to be stifling out there. Make sure you are hydrated. Make sure you're avoiding any kind of strenuous activities as it is not a good situation to be in. Temperatures are going to start to back down tomorrow. Now, highly dependent on your location. I'd say north of the front, you're probably in the mid and upper 60s, honestly. South of the front, lower 70s. So I'm splitting the difference here at 70, mainly cloudy skies and the shower threat will be with us. Perhaps not an all day rain event, but there will likely be some showers popping up on radar and we need the rain, so that's good. Your seven day forecast, 72 on Friday, 67 on Saturday, feeling really good into early next week, we become a bit unsettled.